Good morning, everyone. This is Liani and Riley. <laughs> I keep getting these dogs that don't like pictures and videos. Anyway, um, excuse me, not me, we. It's my husband and I. But um, today's video is just simply a quick reminder that um, you need to take time out just to unwind, to relax, to enjoy the scenery while we still can. Sometimes we take these things for granted, like being able to see things, being able to hear, being able to speak. We take it for granted. We don't realize, and some people don't realize until it's too late. And, you know, you, as you get older, the things start to fade out for some people, not all. And you're like, oh, I didn't even understand what I had then because when it's gone, it's gone. Or if it fades, then, you know, that's just what it is if it's, it's God's will. So while we're still here, you know, let's enjoy the scenery. Let's enjoy the colors. Let's enjoy everything that we can touch, taste, and feel just to be present and not always, you know, head down on our phone. You know, take time if you, you know, like to read books. I like to read books. So, you know, sit in the house. I can't with Riley sometimes because she's so active. But when I get times, you know, just pull out a book. Let it be peace and quiet and joy. Just the sound of the outside noise or, you know, whatever it is. But I like to read books in the quiet, you know, the daylight. Let the natural light come in. No lights on. Open the windows up. Get some fresh air. Um, just take time, drink some tea or coffee, whatever your thing is. And ju it maybe it's juice, maybe it's none of it. it might be juice, but just take time to just look around. Like, see right now I'm in a neighborhood and it's very, very quiet. The birds are chirping. You can hear it rise looking outside, probably looking at squirrels and birds, but just to be present in the moment when you're with your family, if it's a gathering or a dinner or breakfast or whatever it is, just put the phones down, be mindful, be aware of what's going on in, in the conversation so that you can respond the correct way and not just a, you know, quick answer or something just to engage with one another because it's so precious. People are here one minute and then they are truly you know, gone the next and you just want to embrace that time that you have with the people that you're able to. And while they're still here, because just because you're young or old doesn't determine that nothing can happen to you. Uh, like, you know, any sickness or disease, God forbid, or, uh, you know, memory loss, we pray against all these things and rebuke it in the name of the Lord, the Lord rebuke it in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach in Jesus Christ's name. So, but you never know while your limbs are working, you can, you know, move your, your elbows, your joints, your fingers, exercise, you know, eat good food, but try to be healthy. You know, these are things that we take for granted. And then sometimes when people get diagnosed with stuff, then it's like, oh, let me go eat healthy now. Let me do this now. But if you start now before the things even try to appear, they won't, you know, in the name of Jesus. So just be mindful, just be alert, be aware, take time throughout your day, each day, even if it's five minutes, 10 minutes, if you can do 15, awesome. If you can do more than that, that's great. But just take the time, be aware of your environment, or if you drive somewhere where it's nice, maybe it's not as pleasant in your environment, then go somewhere where it is and get that peace of mind, get that relax, excuse me, relaxation and that time for yourself or time with your spouse or your kids or you know, whomever, and just relax and, and enjoy and just be present. Right, Rye? <laughs> She's so focused. So I pray that you all just have a blessed day, a great day, an amazing day. And even if it doesn't start off that way, you have the ability and the power to make it a great day by the blood of Jesus Christ and God the Father to make it great for you and for someone else by just changing your perspective and your mindset and do a reset in your mind and let it conform to the will of God. God bless you all. This is Liani and Rye, Riley. <laughs> Have a great day, guys.